Hello everyone, it's me Tushar Imran. Today I'm visiting one of the most famous places in Bangladesh. This place name is National Museum of Science and Technology. If you visit Bangladesh, don't forget to go there. National Museum of Science and Technology is located at Shohid Shahabuddin Sharok, Agarga. It's walking distance from Agarga Metro Rail Station. National Museum of Science and Technology was found on April 26, 1965 by the Pakistani government and became a part of Bangladeshi Ministry of Science and Technology following the Bangladesh Liberation Oil. It was first based in the Dhaka Public Library and moved a number of times before its permanent home was complete in 1981. This gallery is called Aviation Gallery and I think if you visit there, you must need to know the time schedule. National Museum is open to visitors from Saturday to Wednesday from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m and is weekly closed on Thursday and other government holidays. It's the demo of Titanic. We know that Titanic sank in the early morning hours of 15th April 1912 in the northern Atlantic Ocean, four days into her maiden voyage from Southampton to New York City. It's the inside view of the museum. Now we are seeing the dinosaur foils. The Royal Strills Museum is the only museum dedicated exclusively to the science of paleontology and houses as one of the world's largest displays of dinosaurs. Professor Dr. Hafiza Khatun, erstwhile a postgraduate student in the University of Alberta, visited the exhibition place in May 1983. She collected the foils of dinosaurs and carried those in Bangladesh in 1984. She preserved the foils with care for about 40 years and hand over the National Museum of Science and Technology in February 2021. Science Museum celebrated the 50th anniversary of moon landing. We know that Apollo 11 was the first American space flight that first landed humans on the moon operated by NASA on 20 July 1969. Apollo 11 crew members were Commander Neil Armstrong, Lunar Module Pilot Buzz Aldrin and Command Module Pilot Michael Collins. This bulletproof car used our Honorable Prime Minister and President. It's called Fokker Pendulum. Dunal motion of the Earth can be observed by the change of the plane of oscillation of this pendulum. If you visit the National Museum of Science and Technology, you can see this. It's a nice car. I think this car will be helpful to the student who are studying mechanical engineering. National Museum has several galleries like IT galleries, space science galleries, young scientist galleries, science library and sky observatory and science park. Physics gallery is one of them. Now we are seeing the map and demo of Kaptai Lake. Kaptai Lake is the largest artificial lake in Bangladesh, created in 1960 for a hydroelectric project on Karnapuli River.
National Museum of Science and Technology is a nice place. I think it will be an interesting place those people who are interested to know about science fiction. And if you are interested to know about science, please visit our National Museum of Science and Technology. We are now see the Wells skeleton. If you visit this museum, you will see two types of oil skeleton. Here is the other view of the gallery. National Museum of Science and Technology serves as Bangladesh only science museum and organized science education activities at a national level. If you visit the National Museum, I think you need to know the ticket price. For the local citizenship, the ticket price is BDT 20 Taka, it's same for the international visitors. So don't delay and don't forget to visit our National Museum. It is very helpful for the children. Thanks for watching the video. Good luck.